We're out here in western South Dakota. It's November 15th. Um, I have a tag that opened up a couple weeks ago. We're going to go out this morning and I might try to put a sneak with my bow, but we're going to bring the rifle along just in case. Good luck. Got Austin behind the camera. sat there and stared at him for about 15 minutes. He said, I think we think a 4x5 or a 4x4 white tail. And so we're going to see if we can get around a little bit and get a little closer view on it. I'm switching to the right ball. Oh, What is he? I think he's a 4x5. Probably a 4x4. Four four. He was kind of like quartered to me a little bit, but I could see everything and I was like, I was like way up here. So you were like 60 yards? Yeah. Hey, I like was back here and then I had trees in front of me the whole time. And then I kept sneaking out thinking he was going to jump. But I think I hit him good. Okay, so he was locked on Austin back there so he didn't see me at all so we ended up splitting up so I like belly crawled probably like 60 yards up here and got set up and he was yeah probably 60 yards from me and I kept having trees in front of me so finally I moved to where I had a clean shot and I just assumed Austin would be on him and ready and I shot and I he dropped and then he got up and he ran a little bit he's probably down somewhere right in here but so then I go over the hill to meet with Austin. He, he tells me he wasn't even on it, and he got too cold, so he had to put his hood up and put the camera on pause. That's what I got. There's another deer up there. It's not my deer, though. Austin sees him and I don't. <laughs>
Probably shot him, I mean, just on top of this hill, and he ran over and must have. Looks like he's like slid down. Yeah, right there. I'll take it. Four by four? Nice. <laughs> we sat and stared at him for a long time, and I didn't know if I was going to pull the trigger or not, but I thought that he would taste pretty good, so I did. Austin didn't get it on camera though, but <laughs> that's okay. I was. Literally, I just had turned it off, record, to put my hood up, and bang. <laughs> He's nice, though. Yeah, he is. Doesn't really have much for Brautheins, but... He's got a good frame. Yeah. I'm just happy we'll have good whitetail meat in the freezer. Well, congrats. Proud of you. Yeah, me too. I'm happy with him. He's nice. It's November 16th, uh, West River deer season opens up today. I got the tag today. Hopefully we're gonna head out and find something. Went out last night, kinda scattered around, didn't really see much. I have any deer tag so I can shoot mealy or a white tail, but prefer mealy, but we'll take whatever. So hopefully we can find something today. spot that we haven't been to yet and we haven't seen many deer this morning but we just spotted a pretty good buck. He's pretty tall, pretty wide. I don't know if he's got brow tines but I know he's at least a 4x4 four four, but he's a good tall wide buck. A few does with him. He'll deer so we've got enough terrain here we can try to swing around and get up on top and see if we can find him again. Hopefully get a shot so
spotted this buck a little bit ago and there was a spike bedded up on this ridge line so we couldn't really get in too close. Um, he finally left and walked 40 yards from us and then we got able to sneak up here. They were way down in this deep ravine. Didn't really want to have to try to shoot him down there. Uh, have to figure out a way to get him out of there. So we just assumed they had probably come up but they ran along the Badlands and went over the other ridge. Um, we should still be able to catch up to them. So we'll see what we can do here. So we belly crawled quite a bit along this top ridge line to try to get down in these cup banks because he's probably about 300 yards over this hill right here. So we got in here, closed the distance a little bit, got all hot and sweaty so we had to ditch some clothes but I think we're going to leave the pack up here and just pop up and hopefully we can get shot on him. So Hang on. Okay. You good? Yep. But it just went down right over there. So I just made a pretty good shot on a bug and then kinda of after all morning or all afternoon here. It's starting to rain. We just spotted him. He just he didn't go very far, maybe 30 yards down the hill, but he's just laying there piled up. He's down. Take a look at him. Opening day. Uh, West River, South Dakota. Shot this beautiful buck. I didn't even realize he had brow tines or this little thing. I thought he was just a big wide 4x4. He stood up. He was at uh, 210, I think it was. And he wasn't, I don't know, probably 20 yards up the hill here. So, yeah, he's a, he's a great buck. I'm very happy. West River, South Dakota, tag filled. Allison got hers filled yesterday on a great whitetail. And got mine filled today. Both one shot kills, so I was a little slow on pressing record on Allison's deer yesterday, but we got her done and we got her done today. So, been a fun weekend.